seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Shall we begin? Hi friends and welcome back to channel MI Muhammad Ibrahim Architecture and Interior Designing Projects. Since you all know that I was in Surat from last three months, which I did mention this in my previous travel log. In this video, I will be going to show you the work for which I was working in Surat. It is the project of a bank known as Indusind Bank, which is pronounced also as Indusind Bank. I N D U S I N D Indusind Bank. So this whole project was under the supervision of my own. Exactly, this whole project was a two months project. It means it was a sixty day project of design and development process. It will be difficult for me to show you the whole project in a single video. For this, I have divided this video in different sections or different part. which i would be going to show you in different videos so let us start the first video and bet me it will be really helpful for all the architects or any of the architects or interior designers or the students of such professional fields to learn from this video a lot so let us start the show Indusind Bank spread on a floor having an area of 1070 square feet located in the city of Surat state of Gujarat and in the country of India is a branch of A category standard Now let me just walk you through the design development and completion of Indusind Bank As you can see the site photos on the screen These are the very first pictures which were taken when the work started. Now here you can see the demolition work of old tiles going on. Watch it carefully how they remove the tiles from the floor so that those tiles can be reused for some other purposes. After the demolition of the floor tiles, brick walls were constructed from floor to ceiling with RCC being done in the interval at every 4 feet height. Mainly this RCC is done to strengthen the straight wall ranging to a height more than 4 feet above the floor. After the walls were raised to a height of 7 feet from the floor level, RCC lintels were cast out wherever there were doors provided. How does these lentils are casted? Just have a look at this video.
in this video they have made molds from bricks for casting out lentils in total there are five doors about which lentils would be there first sand is sprinkled in the mold so that the rcc which would be poured would wouldn't adhere to the floor as they are casting it on the floor this is mainly a primitive technique which they are using a thin layer of cemented concrete is laid then 3 to 4 steel bars of 8 mm or 10 mm are reinforced above it then 3 inches or 75 mm thick layer of cemented concrete is poured above the bars to make the mesh the mixture is left to set and dry for 12 to 15 hours the next day all rcc lentils are set to place above all the doors after all the band kaam it means all the new brick work gets finished off demolition work of old brick work got started as you can see on the site these areas which were demolished were previously used as common toilets in this commercial area as we all know before plastering of the walls get started we need to check whether all the brick walls have been cured or not running water is passed on the newly done brick work so that all the bricks can absorb maximum amount of water before they are plastered to avoid leakage and seepage of water ultimately shrinking all the wall paint after the curing work of the brick wall is being done all the walls are plastered from floor to ceiling as we all know electricity plays the most important role in any kind of work to provide light till the end where the whole project gets lit up side by side after 4 days electrical work got started bringing electricity to the site by connecting temporary wires to the bulbs of 200 watt for temporary usage then according to the design layout simultaneously the most important area of the bank it means locker room the work for the same started it is the most interesting part of the work can you believe it this picture was taken on the 7th day on the site after the work started so guys if you like the video give it a thumbs up and if you want to leave a comment you can leave a comment in the comment section box below and if you are new visitor to this channel you can just hit the subscribe button and you can press the bell icon for getting the new updates whenever i post a new video as well as you can always find my videos in my playlist which i have created the 125 videos which you can always refer for architectural and interior designing projects chalo guys take care bye